So we are here at Rafa's garage. Today we're working on this Corolla right here. Um, it's leaking oil, so tranny oil to be exact. So we ended up getting some seals for it. So I think this is the driver's side. Oh. And this one is the passenger side. Here we got turbo. Are you trying to bug me? Hey, let me work. So we're gonna replace both of them. It's pretty easy. Um, same thing, just take off the axles, take off the wheels, and then remove it. Um, so I'm gonna do that real quick. So yeah. Hey, you better not pee on it. Hey, leave that car alone. It's gonna be for sale. So yeah. So I just pulled it in and you can see it's leaking gear oil and let's see where the problem's at and it looks like it's the passenger side. It's over here it's all moist on this and over here is somewhat dry so maybe this is also the culprit maybe. I gotta clean it up and see how it is. So doing this side first, since this side is leaking, basically you take off this 30, 30 nut, 19, 19, and then a 17 there, and a cotter pin if it has it. Um, and then down there, another two bolts, 14s. Disconnect the brake line and the ABS if you have it. This is a 14, and if you have another one, it's usually sometimes a 12. And this should pop out. So this side is already done. Just gotta take those two 14 bolts. I put a drip pan right there because it's gonna leak probably a little bit more. And let's go down there. And like I said, once I removed it, more came out. Let's see how bad it is. Let's see how bad it is. Doesn't look that bad right now, but let's take it out and put a new one. So this is the old one. And this is the new one, OEM. This one looks like aftermarket. And um, I'm not sure that was me or not. I know this was probably me right here. But if you see somewhere, it has a dent. I forgot what I saw it. I saw a dent inside there. That's probably where it was leaking. So now I just gotta find something big enough so I could tap it and put it in there. So there it is. I put it on pretty flush. Now to put the axle on and put everything back together and make sure it doesn't leak this time. And I'm gonna clean that up real quick. So, see if it's coming from that um, drain plug or still coming from here, but I doubt it. This is OEM. So now I'm gonna fill up a little oil. So I'm gonna fill it up from that bolt right there and I believe it's a 17, if not 19. I'm gonna use this, just gravity fed. Probably gonna put a cord in there and make sure it doesn't leak before I really fill it up. And 
so there it is put about a quart in there no leaks yet nothing on the floor that is probably over stuff that i didn't clean up on this side too much gunk but yeah about to put everything on this side and call it a day So this side is all done now to lower down put some oil and call it a day